Hello and welcome to Let's Talk Meshing's Tutorial Tuesday. Today we're going to learn about hiding and showing entities. This feature can be very helpful for complicated models. Have you ever noticed this blue ghost button up on the toolbar? Some people say it actually looks like a clown head, but it's actually a ghost. Well, this is the button to make parts of your model hide or show back up. Let's take a look at how this works. Now right now I have this domain selected. I'm going to go up here. The blue ghost will make things appear. Well, I'm not interested in that. I'm going to push the down arrow to see what the other options are. The white ghost here is going to make it hide. Let's go ahead and push that. Aha, the domain is hidden. Well, let's try it again on these blocks. We have a block here. All right, so I'm going to select that block. I'm going to go ahead and push the white ghost button. Now this should make the block disappear. Ah, did it disappear? Let me see. It did, actually. The block entity itself is gone, but the constituent parts that went into making it are still there. The domains and the connectors are still there. Uh, now, to take this one step further, I'm just going to select this block now. And instead of pushing just the regular hide button here, let's push the down arrow again. Let's go down to the bottom three options. You can see show plus parents and hide plus parents. These are a little bit more complicated, but they're a little bit more useful too. They're going to get rid of the constituent pieces that go into making up the block. Uh, namely the domain. So if I were to choose hide plus parents, it should make the block and the domains go away. There you go. Now the only thing left are the connectors that go into this. A lot of people ask, well, how do I get all these things back that I made hidden? That's an excellent question. Well, the way we do that is we go to the view menu and we turn on what's called show hidden. Now this is going to display all the hidden entities, but it's going to draw them in gray. Ah, you can see they showed up in gray, right? To make them show up uh, permanently, I'm going to select them one at a time here for this example. Uh, and I'm going to go back up to the toolbar and you see all the options here. Now I'm going to select the blue ghost. And let's see if it worked. Aha! It's no longer drawn in gray. It's back to being green. It's permanently being shown. Now let's track this. Uh, let's try this block. Now this block, remember, is hidden. It's being displayed in gray. Let's show it. Notice that uh, what it did show was it brought the block back, but it didn't bring back the constituent parts, the, the parents as they call it. So let's, let's go all the way down to show plus parents. And there we have our domains are back as well. Now this middle one, let's select the block, and then might as well just do show there. And there you go. Now you know how to make parts hidden and how to make them show again. If you like this video, be sure to click the thumbs up button and subscribe to our channel for more videos like this. If you have any questions or comments, drop us a line down below or connect with us on Twitter, which is linked in the description. Thank you all and have a pleasant Tuesday.